Never having used a laser projector before, I've been asking myself for quite some time now whether or not a laser projector is superior to that of a regular LED TV. And after having used two different laser projectors for over two weeks now, I can confidently say that I will not be going back to a TV anytime soon. Welcome to the world of high quality portable projection with the Nebula Capsule 3 and the Nebula Cosmos Laser 4K projector. Both of these projectors are made by Anchor, one of the most trusted consumer tech accessory companies in the market. So here with me today, I have two laser projectors made by Nebula. This little guy right here is called the Nebula Laser Capsule 3. And this big boy over here is called the Nebula Cosmos 4K. Both of these laser projectors are fantastic options and they each have their own unique advantages. Let's start off the video by taking a look at my favorite laser projector to date, the Nebula Capsule 3, and then we'll make our way over to the Cosmos a bit later in the video. How's it going everyone? My name is RJ, and today we're going to be talking about laser projectors. If you're in the market for a new laser projector, or you're just curious about the latest technology, then you're in the right place. Now, you might be asking yourself, why a laser projector? Well, laser projectors offer a number of advantages over a traditional lamp-based projector, making these projectors a great option for both home and professional use. One of the biggest advantages of laser projectors projectors is their brightness, which can sometimes be up to 10 times brighter than the traditional projector, resulting in a much clearer and more vibrant image. Additionally, laser projectors have a much longer lifespan, with some lasting up to 50,000 hours. Now that compared to the traditional projector, which typically lasts around 5,000 hours, is a huge upgrade. This means that you will save money in the long run on replacement lamps. Another advantage is that laser projectors have a faster on-off time, meaning that you can start your presentation or a movie almost instantly. They also maintain a more consistent level of color accuracy and brightness, so you don't have to worry about the image quality degrading over time. Laser projectors are becoming more and more popular in the home theater market, as they do offer a more permanent level of quality without having to install anything into the ceiling, which to me is a big advantage. After watching this video, if you are interested in either the Nebula Capsule 3 or the Nebula Cosmos 4K projector, then make sure to check out the links in the description below and it would be really helpful if you guys do drop a like on this video because that would go a long way in helping me out. Okay, so let's start off with the Nebula Capsule 3. This compact projector is the size of a Bluetooth speaker, and it's perfect for streaming content and watching movies on the go. The combination of a built-in battery and Android TV OS 11 makes the Capsule 3 easy to use and control. Not to mention, being able to project a 120 image in 1080p full HD resolution, you'll feel like you're at the movies no matter where you go. The Capsule 3 is 30% larger than the previous model, the Capsule 2, and it's made out of a sturdy metal with tiny cutouts on the surface for it to be able to breathe. Audio-wise, we have an 8-watt DD Plus watt speaker with Dolby Audio optimization. And the audio experience is decent for the size. It isn't going to fill up an entire room, but it's good enough to provide an enjoyable experience. Honestly, for such a small and compact projector, the sound coming out of this thing is going to be good enough for a lot of people. Over on the back, we have a USB-C, an HDMI, and an auxiliary port, making it super easy to connect with other devices and speakers. Plus, a really cool feature is that you can use this as a standalone Bluetooth speaker, which I did try out and test at my mother-in-law's birthday party, and and everyone at the party had so many questions about the Capsule 3. I told them to wait and watch my upcoming review because this thing is kind of incredible. The image quality on the Nebula Capsule is impressive. As I mentioned earlier, it's able to project 120 image at 1080p full HD resolution. This in particular is another advantage of laser technology. It's more power efficient and produces a brighter image per wattage. This is especially great for nighttime conditions, as the brightness and the color production on the Capsule 3 are very accurate. The colors do stick out without being overpowering. The white balance is also pretty accurate, which is surprising for a projector, but the Capsule 3 nails the white balance in my opinion. The lens on the Capsule 3 is also protected with a piece of glass, making it easy to clean. With other projectors, I've noticed that they do have a tendency to leave the lenses exposed to the elements, which ultimately does build up dust and becomes a mission to clean. A really cool and useful feature is that the Capsule 3 has a built-in camera. This allows for automatic keystone and alignment. So essentially, when you turn on the Capsule 3, the projector aligns the image up automatically. In my own experience, it's even been able to auto-align with great focus on an angle. Pretty impressive stuff. There are two buttons on the back of the Capsule 3, a power button and an input switch button. This enables the projector to be put into Bluetooth speaker mode. Over on the top, we have touch capacitive buttons built right into the projector, which helps you navigate the menu as well as control the volume levels. Over on the bottom, there is a 3 quarter inch thread, which 
which allows you to screw this thing onto a tripod to get that optimal viewing experience. The included remote is simple with necessary buttons that are easy to access. There's buttons for the navigation, calibration, Google Assistant, as well as settings. What's crazy is the Capsule 3 comes with Android TV 11.0 built in. This means that you have access to over 7,000 movies and TV shows, as well as over 7,000 apps. Now, portability is a big advantage of the Capsule 3. I've taken this thing with me all over my house, from my basement to my living room to even my garage. On the weekends, I usually go over to my parents' house to just get together, catch up, and watch a few movies. So being able to take a 900 gram portable projector that's able to protect a 120 image is an incredible experience that the whole family will enjoy. Now, the battery life on the Capsule 3 is about two and a half hours, which is pretty respectable for a projector this small. 2.5 hours is typically the length of one movie or a sporting event like a basketball game. However, if you do need more juice, you can connect it to an external battery pack and keep your watch party going. Now let's take a look at the big boy, the Nebula Cosmos 4K projector. This projector really impressed me from the start. This is a laser projector for under $2,000 and to me it produces better image quality than laser TVs I've seen at people's houses. This is a hybrid projector which means it doesn't have a built-in battery so you will need a power source to power it on. But the image quality is totally worth it with 4K resolution up to 150 inches in size. The hardware is nicely built with cutouts on the side to allow it to breathe. Usually a huge turnoff with a projector this size is the internal fan noise but the Cosmos is very quiet. No complaints whatsoever in that department. You can sit right next to the Cosmos watching a TV or a movie show and you will not notice the fan noise at all. I promise you that. The touchpad on the top rear allows you to control different settings and navigate the menu. It comes with an HDMI input and the lens is once again nicely protected by a glass covering. Over on the front there are cameras and sensors built in to ensure great keystone alignment and great autofocus. I've been using the Cosmos on this tripod and surprisingly it's been able to bear its 10 pound weight as well as give me an optimal angle to get that perfect alignment and image. The Cosmos also features IEA, Intelligent Environment Adaptation Technology, which analyzes a room and displays the projection with no obstructions. This is a great feature for those of you who want to leave the projector semi-permanently in their living room as it delivers a more permanent level of quality without having to screw anything into your ceiling. For instance, in my basement, the wall that I project the Cosmos on isn't the biggest, but thanks to the IEA, it's able to understand the top portion of the image will be cut out. So it's able to adapt and project whatever I'm watching right in the dead center without reaching over the top. That is some impressive technology coming from a laser projector. One of the biggest advantages of the Cosmos is definitely the image quality. As I mentioned earlier, the Cosmos can project an image up to 150 inches and the resolution is in 4K, which is a significant improvement over the 1080p resolution of the capsule. Another big advantage of the Cosmos is daytime visibility. This thing gets bright, 2400 lumens bright to be precise, which means daytime visibility is no issue at all. This makes this the ideal projector for any lighting conditions even during the day. In terms of sound quality, the Cosmos outperforms the capsule. The capsule has an 8 watt DD plus speaker with Dolby audio optimization. And to me, it's decent for its size and it's able to fill up a small size room no problem. However, the Cosmos has two main 10 watt drivers and two 5 watt tweeters, which delivers impressive sound quality for a portable projector. So which out of the two projectors should you buy? Well, it really does depend on your needs and preferences. If you're looking for a super portable option, then you cannot go wrong with the Nebula Capsule 3. This thing is a great choice. It's small and lightweight and has a built-in battery that will give you up to 2.5 hours of standalone usage. Plus, you can connect it to an external battery bank to extend its life even further. This makes the capsule perfect for camping trips or even moving between houses. Both the Nebula capsule and the Nebula Cosmos 4K projector are great options, but they do have different features that may make one more appealing to you than the other. The capsule is small and portable, while the Cosmos is a bit larger, but it has higher resolution and better sound quality. Additionally, the Cosmos is able to project a brighter image than the capsule. You're looking at 300 isolumens compared to 2400 isolumens, which does make the Cosmos great for a semi-permanent setup. But do keep in mind if you're looking for a projector that can be used in a more permanent setting, this is still a hybrid projector that can be moved around if needed. The Cosmos is a bit larger and heavier than the capsule, weighing in at 10 pounds, but it's still manageable to move around quite easily. In the end, it's all about the experience you're looking for. Whether it's a portable big screen experience for camping or more of a permanent setup in your living room, both the Nebula Capsule and the Nebula Cosmos have got you covered. With their impressive image and sound quality, you're sure to have a great viewing experience no matter which projector you choose. So don't be afraid, go ahead and choose the one that suits you best and your needs and enjoy the ultimate viewing experience with Nebula. If you guys enjoyed this video and you did find it informative, then make sure you do subscribe to the channel for a lot more tech related content just like this.
I'd really appreciate it if you guys could drop a like on this video as it does help push the video out and it does favor the algorithm. Remember, if you want to pick up either the Nebula Capsule 3 or the Cosmos 4K, there are links in the description below. As always, thank you so much for watching and don't forget to flex with your tech.